like, like, what's up with niggas? Like, they get locked up, and then they get to the call of you acting like, like it was a different story before they went up in here. Like, how the fuck you even know what's going on on the blogs? To, oh, you was getting ready to ask me to be your girlfriend. What are you talking about, bro? Like, you was, bro. Why do motherfuckers think they could put out one thing and receive another? Like, that's not what you've been putting out, bro. Like, how, and how the fuck is you calling me from that jail with information? Like, who's reporting back to you? The fuck? And y'all know, like, y'all know. Hey. I love it here. Active. It's cracking. It's the only place you can look over it and you might go to jail for it. Because I'm already in jail for it. <laughs> oh, that's my crib, man. Hey, I love you, girl. You know I'm going to be home soon. Way before the date. So, yeah. Let them know I said that. That's why. Okay. And ain't no soldier boy niggas in here. Everybody with the yeah. Everybody with the full sled. Ain't nobody in here talking about some. Oh no. Oh, the address. Why? Bye bye. Please. Hey, Blueface a fool. He talking about some. He love it. Uh, I bet he do love it. It's all men. You know what I'm saying? He get to just chill with all the dudes. Hey. <laughs> That's crazy. He probably feel more free in jail than on the streets. That's why he always doing all this dumb shit to get in trouble. That nigga feel free, man. Hey, but Grishan, she talking about how Blueface trying to get with her, trying to make her his girlfriend. And I guess somebody told Blueface about Krishan. She was in the club grinding on dude. So he blowing her phone up, asking her about that. And the funny thing about it is, niggas always be like that. When they be on the streets, they trying to be with this girl, this girl, the other baby mama, the girl down the street. As soon as they get locked up, they want the man girl or the girl who they like the most to, oh, no, you got to drop all the other niggas for me. You got to hold me down. All this shit. Like, nah, just because you get locked up don't mean that Krishan life supposed to stop. And how you going to call her from jail and try to check her about what she doing on the street? I hear about this shit all the time, bro. Niggas on the street doing dumb shit. He got all these different girls on the street. Soon as he get locked up and he can't do nothing no more. He want to try to call the girls, oh, I heard you out here doing this, or I saw you on the blogs doing this. That shit is ass backwards. Like, you need to worry about the niggas in jail. He said he love it, there. Find you a boyfriend or something. Like, I don't know why he keep on worrying about Krishan. I ain't never heard a nigga say that he love it in jail. Like, that's crazy. Because as soon as he get out, he going to be back to the bullshit. And, like, he going to get out and be a changed man. He want to get in a relationship with Krishan. He going to be faithful. He going to be a good father. Like, no, nah, he not even a father to his own two, other two kids. So he's not about to get out and just be all that shit. So I hope Krishan see through the bullshit and stop trying to hold this nigga down and live her life. I know she's just to get on that game show. She needs to take one of them niggas home or something. Stop worrying about Blueface ass, man. What y'all think about this shit, boy? I'm